Okay. My dear friends, my dear friends, I'm so glad we made it. I'm so glad we made it this beautiful day. And we say thank you to Jesus who made this beautiful day. Yes, the Bible tells us that this is the day that the Lord has made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. And we are choosing to be glad, right? Yes, because it's a day that the Lord has made. I want to say welcome to you. You're welcome to another episode. And God is sure faithful. I think this is the last Friday of the month. Yeah, if I'm not mistaken, this is the last Friday. So you can imagine we made it through how many weeks in April. I think we had about four weeks in April. 30 days in April. And God has been very, very faithful. Although, um, Friday is, uh, what's today's date? Oh my God, I forgot to say that. Oh, 26th. Yes, we have four more days to the end of the month. But really, the most important thing is that the Lord has been so good to us, so good to your family, so good to everyone. So let's go into what we have for today. Uh, let's get to it quickly. Are you ready? <laughs> Ephesians chapter 2, verse 8, in song, it's by grace that we have been saved. It's not of all what we cannot boast. Ephesians 2, verse 8, Ephesians 2, verse 8, Ephesians 2, verse 8. It's by grace that we have been saved. It's not of our works we cannot boast. Ephesians 2 verse 8. Ephesians 2 verse 8. Ephesians 2 verse 8. Great job. And that's the message in the song. It is by grace that Jesus saved us. It is not of our works. Lest we should boast. So we cannot boast. <laughs> We cannot boast because Christ Jesus is the one that did it on the cross because he loved us so much. So it's not because you're a good boy or a good girl or because maybe you're a bad boy or a bad girl. It's because of the love of Jesus or you've been bad. Not let, Let's not call it you whether you're a good boy or a good girl. Whether it's, not, whether, it's not because you've been good rather or you've been bad. No. It is because of the love of Jesus. So that's why the Bible says it's not of your works. It's not because of how good you have been or how bad you have been. So there's no need for you to boast. Whether you've not told a lie before or you have told a lie before. Whether you have not stolen before or you have stolen before. Whether you have not cheated before or you have cheated before. Salvation, being saved, being saved, knowing Jesus coming to experience the love of Jesus, coming to know that Jesus died for you, was buried and resurrected, is not of your works. It is solely on Jesus. It's all about Jesus. Jesus did all of the work, regardless of how good we were or how bad we were, because he loved us so much. And this is why we always say, I always say, yeah, that we must always thank Jesus for his love towards us because he wasn't looking, for example, me, I was not so, a good girl. I never really behaved well, you know, before I came to know Jesus. But Jesus did not look at the fact that Auntie was not a good girl. He saved Auntie as well. And since I've come to know Jesus, I've loved the fact that I am in Jesus because there's so much peace and joy being in Jesus. So we're saying today that salvation is by grace. It's not of your works. It's not about you doing it. You being good. You're not lying. You're not stealing. You're not cheating on your friends or copying another person's book. <laughs> or copying the answers in another person's book. Or you're not doing the things that mommy doesn't want to do. You want you to do. You're not fighting. It's not about that. It's about Jesus Christ. So you must not boast. And is it great to do good, to be good, to do the good things? Yes, it's good to do the good things. Don't tell lies. Yes. Don't steal low. Please don't. And don't fight. Don't cheat on anybody. It's good that you, you know, you do all of those good things. We're just saying that don't stay don't depend on those good things as the reason why jesus saved you because you're a good boy or you're a good girl that's why jesus saved you no it's good to be good 
it's good to do good. But remember and always know that it's not your being good that made Jesus to save you. No, it is beyond that. It is because he loved you with everlasting love. And because he knew that everyone born of a woman or was born into sin. And he came to save all of us from sin, from death, from guilt, from shame, from fear, from so many things. And bring us into the life, in, into life eternal rather. That's what we enjoy in Christ Jesus. So I want you to remember today and always that it is by grace, the grace of Jesus, that you have been saved. It's not of your works, so don't wow. Don't boast. <laughs> Ephesians 2 verse 8. Ephesians 2 verse 8. Ephesians 2 verse 8. So my friends, I know you've been blessed by today's episode. It's so short, but I, that's what I feel like God wants me to share with you today. Remain blessed, my friends. But before we go, we're going to take our song one more time. Let's go. It's by grace that you have been saved. It's not of your works, don't boast. Ephesians 2 verse 8, Ephesians 2 verse 8, Ephesians 2 verse 8. It's by grace that you have been saved. <laughs> no, my Nancy. It's not of your works, don't boast. Ephesians 2 verse 8, Ephesians 2 verse 8, Ephesians 2 verse 8. Let's go one more time. It's by grace that we have been saved. It's not of our works we cannot boast. Ephesians 2 verse 8, Ephesians 2 verse 8, Ephesians 2 verse 8. Great job. Do you want us to take it again? I feel like taking it again one more time. Let's take it one more time. It's by grace that I do like this. Just do this. I have been saved. Yes. It's not of my works. I cannot boast. Yes. Ephesians 2 verse 8. Ephesians 2 verse 8. Ephesians 2 verse 8. Amen. God bless you, my dear friends. I want to believe you've been blessed by today's episode. Keep loving Jesus. Keep living for him. I love you so much. And I'm hoping that next week we'll have fun time with our alphabet songs. God bless you. <laughs>